State Senator, President Pro Tem, Kevin DeLeon, really is a champion. So once again, let's thank State Senator Kevin DeLeon. There needed to be a champion to lead the charge to reinvest in higher education in California. And S State Senator Kevin DeLeon is that person. And we at Asian Americans Advancing Justice and the many organizations that we work with heartily endorse and support SB 1050. We believe that this uh, bill will open up many more opportunities for our youth of all backgrounds in the state of California. We believe that this bill will not only, you know, it, it comes down to very simple things. How do you create a pipeline? If students don't have sufficient college counselors, they and their parents don't know the routes to get into college. If there aren't the programs to support the students for access, and there aren't the programs for retention, students could get in, but they don't succeed. And this bill goes a long way to make a change, a very significant change, with many more resources to reinvest in our higher education system. It expands the pie. It doesn't just divide up what is there. It puts real resources to expand the pie so that students from all backgrounds have an equal opportunity. I just wanted to say that when I first started talking to the President Pro Tem, I said, you know, we're going to do a California poll. The Asian Americans Advancing Justice is going to do a California poll at the beginning of 2016. And so we did that poll and we included a question a series of questions on higher education. I just want to say that the Asian American community strongly supports the key concepts in SB 1050. What do I mean? 85% of Asian Americans who are registered to vote in California support increasing the number of students allowed to enroll in UC and CSUs each year. More than 75% of registered Asian American voters in California support giving students who are low income, English learners, or foster youth a priority for some of those expanded slots. Furthermore, Chinese Americans also found that 75% of them support giving students who are low income, English language learners or foster care youth a priority for those expanded slots. It is very clear that Asian Americans support the key concepts in SB 1050. But let me just call on the matadors and your parents. Uh, you know, when we have seen many great bills in the State Senate, and I want to thank um, State Senator Hernandez Pan and Laura for their great support and leadership as well. Sometimes those bills find a rocky place because there aren't enough students and parents speaking up. And those people who don't like something are the ones who speak up. I would love the matadors and your parents to really speak up. Are you with us? Yeah, yeah. thank you. State Senator Kevin DeLeon, thank you.